I remain silent, but I'm quietly pleased with her first response and angle the candle a little more so that the liquid drips faster. Drop after drop cascade in greater volume on her bare flesh. Her breasts have quickly become coated, and she wriggles with delight at the sensation. I follow a line down her torso, dripping the molten wax in concentric circles around her abdomen. I can see she is preempting every drop globule as it splashes over her. Still warming but cooling all the time, it produces lines down her ribcage and down her sides before solidifying on the bed sheets. I straighten the candle when I reach her pubic mound, the wax ceasing to fall. With the end of the candle I rub it around her pussy, the thick end pushing against her clit, I begin to apply a little more pressure and her hips convulse. Just on the right spot I tease her, making her quit swell with the excitement of it all. Not able to help myself, I lower my head and flick my tongue across the swollen bud before taking it in my mouth and gently sucking it. Oh God, just there, yes. She informs me in no certain terms that she wants me to continue. I pull my head away a few inches and insert the blunt end of the candle into her opening. Her lips part easy to allow it access and it glides smoothly inside. I grasp hold of the candle a third of the way from the flame. In slow deliberate movements I fuck her pussy. Each insertion going deeper and I build up her rhythm until she is writhing beneath me. Oh fuck yes! She screams out in pure ecstasy and I speed up the pace. The surface of the candle is wet with her secretions and I endure the hot wax that is now dripping onto the back of my hand. A small droplet catches her at the bottom of her pussy and she flinches. I imagine her closer to orgasm, so withdraw the candle and then dribble hot liquid over her pouting lips. Once again her hips convulse and under the onslaught of the searing hot wax. I decide to give her some relief and continue to trail the candle along her thighs. Lingering for a while to build up a steady flow, she is mewing like a contented feline, wanting to be stroked some more. Who am I to refuse? I'm back to my normal self and reveling in every single second of it.